Have you ever wondered what would happen if all the glaciers melted at the same time? Picture this. Towering mountains of ice spread across the globe from the frosty peaks of the Himalayas to the icy expanse of Greenland. These are our planet's glaciers, nature's icy reservoirs, but they're not just beautiful to behold, they're vital to our survival. Glaciers are like Earth's water towers. They store about 69% of the world's fresh water. To give you a sense of the volume we're talking about, if you were to take all that ice and spread it out, it would cover the entire surface of North America with a sheet of ice over one and a half kilometers thick. That's roughly equivalent to the height of the world's tallest skyscraper, the Burj Khalifa. But here's the rub. Our glaciers are in a state of flux. They're melting, and they're melting fast. The culprit? Climate change. As the Earth's temperature has risen, so too has the rate at which our glaciers are melting. This isn't just a hypothetical scenario or a story spun out of thin air, this is happening right now. The World Glacier Monitoring Service has reported that over the past five decades, the rate of ice loss from glaciers has roughly doubled. The ice that took centuries, even millennia to form, is disappearing before our very eyes and at a pace that's accelerating. This poses a sobering question. What if all this ice were to melt? What would that mean for us, for our planet? You might think, well, it's just water, how bad could it be? But the reality is far more complex and far more dire than you might imagine. So, if all this ice were to melt, what would happen? To answer that, we'll need to dive deeper into the science behind these icy giants, explore the potential ripple effects of such a colossal meltdown, and examine the steps we can take to prevent it. Stay tuned as we embark on a chilling journey into the heart of our planet's icy wilderness. Firstly, the most immediate impact would be on sea levels. Yes, the moment glaciers begin to melt, the sea levels begin to rise. But why is that? Well, it's because glaciers are massive bodies of dense ice, built up over thousands of years through snowfall. When this ice melts, it doesn't just disappear, it turns into water and flows into the oceans, causing the sea levels to rise. Now you might be wondering, how much could sea levels really rise? Consider this, if all of the world's glaciers were to melt, it's estimated that sea levels could rise by a staggering 20 to 25 meters. That's about the height of a seven-story building. Imagine the world's coastlines redrawn by such a dramatic rise in sea levels. Coastal cities, home to millions of people, would be significantly impacted. Iconic cities like New York, Miami, and Shanghai could find themselves partially, if not entirely, submerged. The picturesque islands of Maldives, known for their stunning turquoise waters and white sandy beaches, would vanish beneath the waves. And it's not just the cities and islands that would be affected. Coastal ecosystems such as wetlands and mangroves would be destroyed, leading to a loss of biodiversity. The impact on marine life would be devastating, with coral reefs suffering from increased water temperatures and ocean acidification. The human cost would be immense, too. Millions of people would be displaced, losing their homes and livelihoods. The infrastructure that we take for granted, like roads, bridges, and power plants, would be at risk. The economic implications would be catastrophic, with industries such as tourism, fishing, and agriculture hit hard. In essence, the melting of glaciers isn't just about a rise in sea levels, it's about a domino effect that would tip the balance of our planet's ecosystems, affecting life as we know it. It's about the displacement of millions of people and the loss of biodiversity. It's about the potential collapse of economies and societies. So what would happen if all the glaciers melted at the same time? With cities underwater, where would millions of people go? That's a question we must grapple with and fast. The melting glaciers wouldn't just flood our cities, they would also cause climate chaos. Imagine a world where weather patterns are as unpredictable as a roll of dice. That's the reality we'd face if all the glaciers melted at once. The disappearance of these icy giants would have a profound impact on our global weather patterns. You see, Glaciers play a critical role in maintaining the Earth's thermohaline circulation, a fancy term for the global conveyor belt of ocean currents. These currents transfer heat and nutrients around the world, regulating our climate. Without glaciers, this system would be thrown off balance. The result? A climate in disarray. As the conveyor belt slows down, we could see dramatic shifts in weather. Areas once known for their mild climates could experience extreme heat waves. On the flip side, places used to warmth could be hit with bone-chilling cold. But it's not just about hot and cold. The melting glaciers could also lead to an increase in severe weather events. We're talking about more than just a few extra thunderstorms. We could see superstorms, the likes of which we've never experienced before. 
these megastorms could bring with them unprecedented levels of destruction. And then there's the issue of drought. With the disruption of weather patterns, rainfall could become scarce in some regions. These areas could turn into parched wastelands, with the soil too dry to support crops or livestock. This could lead to widespread food shortages and famine, affecting millions of people worldwide. In short, the loss of glaciers wouldn't just raise sea levels, it would send our climate into a tailspin. We'd be living in a world of extremes, with weather that's unpredictable and often severe. The melting glaciers would transform our world from a place of relative stability to a planet of extremes. The world as we know it would be drastically different. Moreover, the loss of glaciers would have a significant impact on our freshwater supply. This statement is not an overstatement. Rather, it is a chilling reality that we could face if all the glaciers melted at the same time. Let's start by acknowledging that glaciers are not just beautiful spectacles of nature. They are also natural reservoirs of fresh water, storing about 70% of the world's supply. Many regions around the globe rely on this meltwater for their daily needs. These include parts of the Andes in South America, the Himalayas in Asia, the Alps in Europe, and even the Rocky Mountains in North America. In these areas, glaciers act as a buffer, releasing water during the dry season when rainfall is scarce. They provide a consistent flow of water, helping communities survive through periods of drought and ensuring that crops get the water they need to grow. You could say that glaciers are like nature's water towers, serving a crucial function in our ecosystem. But what happens if these natural water towers were to disappear? The consequences could be dire. Without glaciers to store and gradually release water, we could face severe water shortages. Imagine turning on your tap one day and finding nothing comes out. It's a frightening thought, isn't it? Furthermore, the potential for conflicts over water resources could increase. Water is a basic human need and when it becomes scarce people are forced to compete for it. This could lead to local conflicts or even international disputes as countries fight over access to dwindling water supplies. In a world without glaciers, fresh water, the very essence of life, could become a scarce commodity. This is not just about losing a beautiful part of our natural landscape, it's about losing a vital lifeline that millions of people depend on. It's about a future where water, a resource we often take for granted, could become a rare and precious commodity. Without glaciers, water, the essence of life, could become a scarce commodity. So, let's protect our glaciers, let's protect our freshwater supply, and let's protect our future. The picture painted by a world without glaciers is grim, but it's not too late to act. Our glaciers are not just magnificent frozen landscapes, they are crucial to our survival, acting as Earth's thermostat and freshwater reservoirs. Their disappearance would trigger catastrophic changes, but we can prevent this grim future. It begins with understanding and addressing the root cause, climate change. Climate change is driven by an increase in greenhouse gases, such as carbon dioxide and methane in our atmosphere. These gases trap heat, causing our planet to warm up. This warming is what's causing our glaciers to melt. But how do we combat this? First, we can reduce our carbon footprint. This means making choices that release fewer greenhouse gases. Simple actions like using energy-efficient appliances, reducing, reusing, recycling, or even choosing to walk, bike, or use public transportation instead of driving can make a significant difference. Secondly, we can support renewable energy. Renewable energy sources like wind, solar, and hydroelectric power release fewer greenhouse gases compared to fossil fuels. By supporting renewable energy, whether it's installing solar panels on your home or advocating for more renewable energy in your community, you're helping reduce the demand for fossil fuels and thus slowing down global warming. Thirdly, we can advocate for change. This could mean voting for leaders who prioritize the environment, supporting businesses that are eco-friendly, or even joining or donating to organizations that fight climate change. We must use our voices and our wallets to demand action from those in power. Lastly, education is key. The more we understand about climate change and the effects of melting glaciers, the more motivated we are to act. So, share what you've learned today with others. Knowledge is power. The fate of our glaciers and our planet is in our hands. We have the power to slow down and eventually stop the melting of our glaciers. But we must act now. The longer we wait, the more irreversible damage will be done. Let's work together to ensure a future where our glaciers continue to thrive.